Good morning, friends. Today's book is called Kite Day, a bear and mole story. This book is by Will Hillenbrand. It looks like he wrote the words and took the pictures. That looks pretty cool. A bear and mole story. What is a kite? I see the letter K here for kite. Have you ever played with a kite? If you look over here on this page, I see a big yellow kite. A kite is a diamond shape, and it's a toy that you can play with. It floats in the sky. It gets caught in the wind. It has to be a really windy day for kites. So let's see how Bear and Mole's kite day goes. Here's Bear. It says, Bear looked at the sky. Could it be, he wondered, He tilted his head up, whiff, whiff, whiff. What is he doing? I think he's using his nose, he's sniffing. He smiled and then shouted, kite day! Bear rushed home, huff, puff, huff. Come on, Bear waved to Mole, kite day is here. This is Mole down here. What is Mole doing? He's digging. Good job. Bear collected. What does that mean, collected? Well, I see he's got his box of string and he's pulling things out. I think he's collecting the string. He's gathering it to use later. Mole studied. Bear snatched. Bear measured and cut. Mole drew. They both constructed. Can you say that word, constructed? Constructed. It means they built the kite. They made it. Finally, they raced outside into the meadow. The kite flew, zoom, zoom, zoom. Look at it way up there. And we can see there's all this wind blowing the kite into the air. It soared up, up, up. You can see there's the string connecting it to Mole. He's holding on to the kite. But what's happening here? I see big gray clouds coming in. It says, then dark, heavy clouds rolled in. Rumble, rumble, rumble. The breeze grew into a gust and then, snap, the kite string broke. Away, 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 spun the kite. Oh no, screamed Mole and Bear. Down, 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 plunged the kite. Save that kite, shouted Mole. The two ran. Hurry, 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 urged a bear. Look, there is the kite. Where's the kite falling? The kite is falling down. Mole stopped. He lifted his head up. Splat. Splat, splat, rain pelted the broken kite. Look, cried Bear. Oh, sighed Mole. Look, what's in the nest? Chirp, 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 squeaked the chicks. There's baby birds in the nest. Thank you, sang the mother bird. What happened? Their kite fell in the tree, but they're gonna leave it there. Why? I think it might be shielding the baby birds from the storm. It's keeping the rain off of them, so they're not so wet. And that's the end of the book. That was a pretty short one. Oh, that's hard to look at. <laughs> All right, friends, thank you for joining me. It looks like there's a couple different bear and mole books. 
So maybe we'll look at some others, but I wanted to take a look at this book because lately it's been pretty windy at my house. And if it wasn't so rainy, I might be out there with a kite myself. Have you ever flown a kite? If you haven't, now is a good time to do it. It's getting warm outside. All right, friends, have a good day and I'll see you all tomorrow.